I'm standing at the end of one of the most famous soys in Bangkok, Sukhumvit 11. Let's go back to the beginning and tell you why tourists love or must stay at this street in Sukhumvit. So here we are guys, this is the main entrance of Sukhumvit Soy 11. The most famous street in Sukhumvit, where tourists love to stay when they are in Bangkok. Now the first thing you can see that it's just next to BTS Tana station. So imagine how easy to reach here, and not so far from BTS Asok. That's concerning how to reach here. A big 7-Eleven just at the corner of the Soy. Now let's walk inside and explore together why this street is famous and moreover, what are the new pubs, restaurants and hotels that are now available. From the beginning of the street you can see how busy is this place. The first thing you will see that there are lots of food options. There was here at this narrow street, street food corner. Nowadays it's gone. Many things change in Sukhumvit 11 after the pandemic. Another thing you will see a lot of massage shops at the beginning of the soy. Well guys, if you don't know, soy means street in Thai. So this is soy 11. The best thing that you have sidewalks to walk and the street vendors are not on the sidewalks. Here at the opposite side you have a new pub and bar. Lots of pubs and bars recently opened here so it's attracting more tourists to stay. Street food options are a lot too, besides some shopping. You can see also at the opposite side Zanzibar bar and restaurant is back with live music and good food. It was closed for a while. And here you have a Japanese restaurant. Let's continue walking, you can see how many exchange shop services are available next to each other. The rates are good and you can choose which one is the best. At the opposite side you have some street food options, the prices are so cheap here, but if you like to sit on the street, cars and tuk-tuks passing, unless you like to sit in the restaurant. Like this one, the Indian restaurants, the prices are not much cheap here, that goes for all the international food available here. So these are the new generation of trucks in Bangkok selling wheats. So not only at the shops, they are everywhere. And here you have another Japanese restaurant, Tacos Bell. So you can see how wide the options are, that means lots of tourist stays at the soy from different nationalities. Now here at the opposite side, this is one of the new kind of pub, bars, nightlife spots where you can have some drinks, some fun, maybe some company. Just located at the middle of the street. Usually loud music and lots of action. So you can check it, let me know if you like it. It's quite a big place and on weekends it's so crowded. Today is Friday, seems not busy that much. Here at this side you have the wine connection, a classy place to sit and enjoy some wine, if you are not into pubs and bars. This is next to Ambassador Hotel, one of the options to stay in this street. And at the opposite side you have a new place, street food market to eat. I've tried for two times, not that much. Anyway, Sukhumvit 11 is not the best place to eat street food. 
but you have some options the international restaurants and the food trucks will give you better options and quality but of course little bit pricey lots of people around as you can see this street gets busier after sunset and especially on the weekends Now also concerning the shopping there are some options but again this is not the best place for shopping unless you need something urgent. In my opinion enjoy the pubs, bars, the international restaurants or maybe some weed from the trucks. This is one of the most famous sports bar, the old German beer bar, and also another one on this side. These spot places are usually busy. My favorite is the German beer bar. The beers are cold, the food is good, and the prices are not high. But on weekends it's too busy, so you better come early. Next to it you have another cool place to sit, eat and drink, more classic Hemingway. And at the opposite side you have Grand President Hotel, if you wanna stay here. Lots of hotels and options, I have made an entire vlog about it. If you wanna stay of course at this street. This bar is new, if you like to try and next to it you have an Indian restaurant. So all these shops, bars and pubs are making this street so famous and of course the budget hotels. Wherever you look, lots of options and trust me, if you are here on the weekend, all of them will be full. Sometimes you won't find even one table to sit and eat. Now here you have another hotel, Merker Hotel, it's a good choice to stay at this soy. Tuk Tuk drivers are everywhere, a good place to hunt newbies. And as you see, a nice place in front of the hotel to sit, eat and drink. In this so you have two Hillary bars, a good place to have some beers and play pool. There are lots of Hillary's in Sukhumvit, some of them are in soy form. Also you have a nice place to eat Argentinian steak next to Merker Hotel. And at the opposite side as you can see, a place to eat pizza. You will never get hungry or out of options in this street. So be careful while you are walking at night. You can see here a big shop selling wheat, just on Citadens Hotel. So guys, lots of wheat shops and trucks in this street. At the opposite side you have some nightclubs like the Levels. At this street you have also Sugar Club, but they open their doors late. And most of them you have to book if you wanna sit VIP or get tables.
At the end of the soy, you have a street inside a street, a secret soy. If you enter, you will find lots of bars and massage shops, Indian restaurants, some new shops. So once you are walking at the right side, this is almost at the end of the street. Check it, you may find things that interest you. After this you have a tattoo shop and lots of burgers and pizza restaurants, food trucks. We are almost at the end of the soy, but you still have some interesting shops and bars at the left side, let's first walk. Just at the end you have a big 7-Eleven and coffee club. If you walk from here to the right you have some good hotels if you don't want to stay at the middle of the action. But if you walk to the left then let me show you what we have. That was the main street, here at the left side you have a nice seafood restaurant. Never tried it, but I see lots of people usually packed. And once you walk from here, you will be in front of Insanity nightclub. Now as you can see it's dark. Gone with the wind, wind of covid. It was a nice place to party. Well, there are some pubs and bars at the other side. Let's walk till the end. Well, my friends, as you saw along the vlog, this is one of the most famous, busiest, best places you can stay in Sukhumvit, Sukhumvit 11. Now it's time for me to enter the 7-Eleven and get some refreshing drink. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned and subscribe for more from Live Love Thailand.